every sports fan's favorite time of year, college basketball tournaments, but what's a sporting event without a killer food game, right? Yeah! yeah. So today, we're taking our shot with some slam dunk snacks. We're back with the highest rated <laughs> sports mixed with cooking program on TV, Snack Center! We've already seen some amazing plays today, so let's get right back into it. Can we put up the snack cam? <laughs> Lonnie, yeah! it looks like this sports spectator is enjoying a pizza basketball. <laughs> wow, her form is excellent. How do you make them? Lonnie, it is so easy. Okay, first, take one can of store-bought biscuit dough and cut the biscuits in half. Then you're going to flatten out each half so that they form flat, round circles like I've already done here. Then you're going to add a small amount of marinara sauce onto the dough, followed by one pepperoni mm -hmm. and one cube of mozzarella on each biscuit. <laughs> Let them know. Yes. Then you're going to add additional pizza toppings too, like peppers and onions, really whatever you want. Next, you're going to bring the edges of the dough together like so. Uh -huh. So they form a ball like this, can, yeah. uh -huh. making sure there are no gaps for the filling to leak out. Take your Don't time, baby. copy anything that I have done, OK? <laughs> Then you're gonna lay, it's not supposed to look like this, people. <laughs> then you're gonna lay the pizza balls on a baking sheet lined with greased parchment yeah. paper like so. Okay. <laughs> then you're gonna finish up by spreading a butter mixture on top of the balls. I've combined three tablespoons of melted butter, two minced garlic cloves, salt and pepper to taste, and one tablespoon of Italian seasoning here in this bowl. Ooh. Then you're just gonna, Lonnie. You're gonna brush this on top of your ball. Spread it on yep. there. Then follow up. Okay. Just, Ow. I gotta put a little bit more on the ball. Yes. There you go. Yes. Then you're gonna spread. Well, no. You're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna sprinkle some shredded Parmesan cheese on top of the balls. You're gonna pop that in the oven at 375 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Serve them with some marinara sauce on the side. And then you've got balls! <laughs> Good, good job. We've got time for one more play, and this one might be the play of the game. Show me the snack cam. Oh. oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it, Lonnie. Tell me this isn't what I think it is. Uh, now, Tamara, now yes. they told us we would not see this one today, mm -hmm. but here it is, right before our eyes. It's a basketball layer dip. That's what it is. <laughs> Lonnie. Well, baby, it's all in the risk, okay? Okay. And it's in the layering. First things first, I, Lonnie, mix 16 ounces of refried beans with a package of taco seasoning mm -hmm. like this. You take that mixture and you just spread it at the bottom of a round, deep dish like I already did here. Next, you're going to keep layering. You spread one cup of sour cream like that, right? Mm. See how I spread? I know how to spread it right, oh. okay? Oh, Lonnie. Then you take that guacamole and you spread that guacamole like that, right? You know, just keep spreading it. Cover it all up. Let it get coverage. Yes. Then you take you some salsa, about one cup, and you spread that salsa out. You see that? Yes. And then you take some shredded lettuce. You spread that shredded lettuce. Yummy. And then you top it off with one cup of diced tomato. Spread it. It's getting pretty now. Get real yes. pretty. Then you take Mexican cheese, and you make sure you spread it all around. Cover cheese, it all please. up. So, yes, get you here. Mm -hmm. Here's some of that right there. Cheese. And then you spread it out like that, and then you take these diced um, olives, and then you make a line like a basketball, right? Oh. And I ain't got time for that, but... <laughs> In the end, it's gonna come out like this, Tam. Yeah. You got a ball! <laughs> <laughs> right at the buzzer. That's all the time we've got for this edition of Snack Center, featuring our slam dunk snacks. For all of these recipes, just visit thereal.com.